It's Leo. It's been a long time, I know. So today I'm here. Today we're going to tackle another leak of problem. It's called first bad version. Let's take a look at it. Suppose there is a version control interface contains n versions of product from 1 to n. And also there's an API called is bad version to check whether the input version is a good one or a bad one. Versions after the first bad version is all, all bad. Okay, let's let's draw it. So good, 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 and bad, 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 bad. Okay, it looks like this. So it instructs us to write a new API called find first bad version, where n is the total number of versions that returns the version number of the first bad one. Okay, so basically we're finding something in this array. And please try to minimize the total number of is bad version calls. So, uh, when I first think about it, I think of brute force. Okay, I could I simply just traverse the whole array to see the where the first bad version comes. Okay, but that will lead us to a linear time complexity, which is O n. Can we do it better? If we view good as one and bad as two, this is a sorted array with only two elements, repeatedly representing two elements. So we can consider using binary search, right? Okay, let's see if it works. So we're going to put the first one as left and the last element as right. And the middle one will be the middle. And if it's a bad version, we're going to move right to middle. Can we move it to middle minus one? No, because we're losing this first bad version. So right can only be middle. Okay. And what about if it's good version? Let's see. Let's see if it works. So can we say that left is equal to m plus 1? So can we move l here? Yes, of course, because the first bad, ver bad version is still in the range we're searching for. So we can have left equals to mid plus 1. Okay. And there are only another problem here. Should we, how many elements should we have in our search loop? Should there be three or two or one? Let's see if it works. So we don't need three, okay? Because we only want to find one element. We don't need three. If it's only two, the first bad version is right on our left, okay? But if it looks like this, I think we need to do another binary search because if we want to return only one element, we have to return left or right, but we can return left in this case and right in this case. So if you want to return left, we have to make another binary search to make L to R. So in this case, the middle would be here and after the binary search, the L would come to this place. In this case, we return left. We can still find the first bad version. So, hmm, I got it. Now let's write it. Uh, let's first categorize our left boundary to, I think it starts with one, okay? One. So the last, the right boundary should be N, right? And our looping condition is well left is less than right and we have our middle left plus right minus left divided by two so if uh, the API is called is bad version okay is bad version if mid is a bad version we are going to move right to mid. 
else, if it's not a bad version, we're going to make left to mid plus one. And after the loop, we're going to make, we're going to return left. Okay. So I think it works. Let's see. Yeah, perfect. Okay, see you next time. I think this is a classical binary search. The next time I will bring something, something that is more difficult. See ya.